What up my freaks, Ruin and Sight here with part 15 of my Warhammer 40k Chaos Gate Demon Hunters campaign. So as we saw last time, we found a pretty fun mission that uh, t uh, seemed like it would be easy, but then turned out to be pretty fun as we got suddenly surrounded by a bunch of enemies, though we did come out ahead and uh, ended up not really taking any damage at all. Uh, unfortunately, the wards were absolute trash, or at least I, th I thought they were trash, and uh, we got really nothing out of it except for promotions, which I suppose is a decent reward in and of itself. Uh, let's begin the promotions Iolanthus. now. Let's start with you, Iolanthus. I love you, man. Uh, we have... We could buff up Warp Charge. Uh, Alright, you have one point in Cybolt for no real reason. Uh, huh. So yeah, I was absolutely thinking of buffing up Iolanthus to just go for straight up melee powerhouse. Uh, it just seems like it would be a nice thing since we got the other guy very tanky. The question, though, I suppose... Is, let's see, afflict bleed from hammer hand, uh, or do we just go for, what is this? Rend the unclean, oh, that's the psychic blast area, hmm. So I guess this is what we want to do, buff up four strikes, armor break one, armor break one. Uh, is that even worth it? Ruthless precision on the side crits with a man like that. Yeah, you know what, the, force, the precision thing is nice, if nothing else. Hmm. I might have to go through warp charge of this to get it anyway, To, but it's just for bleed. I say that doesn't seem like a big idea. It makes me. Oh right, I was gonna put him to bull rush or crushing charge. Why do I keep calling this bull rush? Uh, <laughs> I was gonna put him into crushing charge anyway. So maybe we'll give him crushing charge first and then think about this. Might be a better idea. I'm not necessarily super into hobbled, but I like the idea of being able to charge like this uh, and stun everybody and hit multiple enemies at once. Uh, the, the other stuff like the extra HP, the now the plus one stun might also be very useful, but then we'd have to go through either the hobbled thing, afflicted target gains minus two move speed, or the health thing. Well, either way, we can't get it right now, so let's get warp charge for honor of the chapter, which is a pretty decent pickup anyway, and then crushing charge as well. I suppose one of the problems with this is that warp uh, crushing charge costs two willpower, and is there any point in which it would be better? to use two willpower on himself to do the crushing charge and deal one damage rather than giving up the willpower via honor the chapter to a better damaging unit like a interceptor that's the real question here i suppose this might help in terms of repositioning but he could just physically move like that which kind of makes me think maybe this isn't that good of an ability although of course i could be wrong and then we could, we could, if we wanted to, just skip that and go into this. Strike all targets within the blast area. Yeah, but this guy, it's not like he's going to teleport. And the blast area, I take it... Yeah, the blast area is centered on himself and doesn't do much damage. Great for zombies, but probably not super useful otherwise. No stun. Hmm. Plus one blast area and plus two damage. So this could increase the damage to nine, which would be pretty considerable. That's four strikes gain plus one damage. I do want ruthless precision either way, though. I think. You know what? Let's 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 get let's get him crushing charge. I feel like we should have crushing charge at at least one. So you'll be at level five, and then you can go uh, six, seven, eight. So you'll have enough points to get those either way. You could even you could even upgrade your uh, Aegis shield afterwards if you feel like it, or you could move a little bit into this and get uh, and get run the unclean if you want to, or we could just further upgrade stuff like making hammer hands stronger. Eh. I think that's okay. Let's do that. Man, now I'm just thinking, wouldn't Rend the Unclean when fully upgraded be a better buff than Bull Rush? A crushing charge damn it. <laughs> oh man, I don't know. Hmm. I'm kind of actually tempted to oh wait we can't you know what we could do? We could just not get it right now, and I could think about it. Because we, we were going to get this anyway. And it's probably a good idea to pick up the extra crit damage on Hammerhand. This feels kind of meh. Like, I, don't, I feel like I, once again, don't really care about the bleed, but I do want Ruthless Precision. Oh, and actually, speaking of Ruthless Precision, uh, one, two, three. So, we, yeah, you know what? If we do this and this, the next level up, we could go for Ruthless Precision. Yeah, you know, that's worth it. You guys let me know what your experience has been with uh, how useful crushing charge is. 
Because the plus, the, it's the fact that it only does one damage bothers me, but the plus two stun is good. But generally speaking, if this does a ton of damage, this might have more use cases than this. But who knows? Uh, confirm... Yes. Alright, so that's you. And then the other promotion was Mr. Apothecary. Ah, damn, I clicked on the wrong thing. Uh, Apothecary. Uh, you have one ammo for your... You have plus one ammo for grenades, but you can't use grenades. Uh, if only you were a grenadier, if only you were a purgator. Uh, you can currently go towards Surgical Adept, which I think we definitely will. Wait a second. We could upgrade the Iron Arm Biomancy to increase the stun. Or we could start moving down here towards... Knights affected by Purify have their afflictions removed immediately. I mean Purify. I'm confused. Is this saying that it adds Purify to Endurance Biomancy? Oh, you don't have Endurance Biomancy. Target Knight within run range to gain plus 25 resistance and to Purify. Oh, so that we wouldn't have to rely on Battlefield Medicine to necessarily heal somebody. Not that you respect towards Battlefield Medicine anyway. Oh, actually, wait. It's not the Battlefield Medicine it's our, that purifies anyway. It's the... It's the Servo Skulls. Hmm... I do really want to get Sympathetic Biomancy, though. So the question is whether we go for Surgical... Well, we have to go for Surgical Adept. Uh, we get Sympathetic Biomancy after two points of this anyway. So the question, I guess, then, is do we get Endurance Biomancy right now, or do we go for the extra stun ooh, or the upgrade? You know what? Let's get the extra turn. St extra stun is great, but the extra turn is real great. Uh, we also probably need to get the willpower upgrade for you ASAP, so this most likely, and then if we could reach another one, that would also be great. Hmm. There's the bleeding stuff. Man, is there no extra willpower out of all this? Yeah, hopefully we'll get some armor that upgrades his willpower because he really needs it. Anyway, that's it for you, Apothecary. Let's go back to Strategium, and I guess let's go to next mission. If we have time, we'll have a chat with some of our uh, some of our people on board later on. But for now, away we go, since we can't reach us. I just want to double check. I did this last time, but yeah, okay. You know, my memory's faulty, so who knows. Go here, please. We're going to advance closer to that other place with the three bloom once again. And then hope that there's a, uh, a bloom spawn there. Man, this this is looking like a pretty great year for Warhammer games, isn't it? Uh, between Warhammer 3 and uh, and this Chaos Gate game, pretty happy with it. Uh, let's see, you go here, confirm. Yes. All right, and then I guess we'll just sit here for a little while and advance our time. All right, go. Will something interesting happen? There we go, already Bloom Spawn's available. On our hands while the bloom spreads unchallenged. Commander, I am detecting a new form of Bloom activity that threatens to spread the plague into nearby systems. We should prioritize it. Uh, all righty, let me guess, it doesn't have Servitor. Yes, it has Servitor. Well, then I guess we know what we're picking. Uh, kill eight enemies. Oh, I'm, I'm excited about this. Perhaps there is... What do you mean, Mission Unreachable in time? Okay, I must have not uh, selected it. Yeah, okay, I didn't select it. Uh, you have another Warding Stave, a level 2 Termi Armor, level 2 War Gear, uh, level 1 Incinerator, and level 5 Apothecary. I did want to try out a Bleedy Apothecary. But once again, we do have to save up our requisition for the next Grandmaster's Report. Well, 29 days. It should be okay. And what do you have rewarding? Requisition, garbage. So, garbage, basically. Another Demon Hammer is not too bad, though. Another Storm Bolter is nice. And a rank four purgator. Hmm. And what about here? Let me guess. Twenty servitors. Ooh, two grimoires. Ah, oh, damn, that's nice. I wonder if we could reach here from the other place. I don't really care about the rest of this, but uh, two grimoires is so much better than one requisition. Like hilariously so. Hmm, I wonder. Well, obviously this is the place we're going to, so go there we shall. Let me guess, there's going to be an interception or an intervention. I knew it. I freaking knew it. <laughs> it felt like a while. I feel like there's one after every new bloom, right? Warning. Our sea reserves are being handled carelessly. Proper container protocols are not being followed. We are in a race against time, Commander. Minor contamination is of little threat to the Grey Knights. 
Uh, you know what? Our research has been screwed over several times already. I think we're safe to say some nights will be unavailable for enough time because we now have enough nights to be able to get to be getting on with uh, what we're dealing with. So let's fortify the Libras with protective wards. Uh, hopefully they don't suffer wounds and hopefully they're just unavailable, but uh, we'll see. Hopefully it's not like a crazy amount of time either. Hopefully I don't come to regret this. I'm really hopeful today. Hope is the first step on the road to disappointment. Fortify. Whatever it takes. Just ensure they do not disturb me. Oh, our best knight. Well, I guess the other ones need to level up anyway. That's fine, though. Uh, and I didn't see who the other one that's away is, but well, I guess we'll see when we get there. Go, go, go. Uh, hey, ship project complete just as we get there. Prevents warp storm risks. So if we could reach this, we would be able to and get those two grimoires. Although, wait, didn't this one have some good rewards? Oh, we'll see about it. Anyway, praise the Omnissiah. The Gellerfield device has been reinforced. We can now skim the Immaterium and not be buffeted by warp storms or attacked by demons. Pretty sure that's not how Gellerfields work. Uh, but anyway, Brother Ektar expressed disappointment that he will not get to smite any warp spawn, but I chided that I would not invite corruption onto the Edict's decks merely to feed his wrath. All right, Ektar's growing on me. Uh... I'm pretty sure you can still be buffeted by warp storms despite a Geller field. It depends on the strength of the warp storms. Ships are lost in the warp with Geller fields all the time. It doesn't necessarily mean that they failed. They could just be knocked off course or something. Anyway, it's the vagaries of the warp. Uh, what do we have in terms of Servitor? 17. We've got this. Once again, I am very tempted to get this, though the 24 days is iffy. If this didn't cost 12 or... If this didn't cost 16 Servitors, I would go for this. But we are about to get rewards for Servitors. Right now. So this is a decent pickup as well. You know what, perhaps this is the time to get this. Since we're about to get rewarded by... I just want to double check that I didn't misread it. Yeah. Alright, well then. Uh, damn, wrong place. Uh, ship status. If we get this right now, then we can significantly reduce the amount of time it takes this, and we would be able to do it. And then we'll just pick whatever is the cheapest afterwards to start uh, building everything else. Oh, I did want to get this as well. Oh yeah, but reduce the time. Is yeah, you know what? Yeah, now's the time to constructing, constructing to be constructing the increase. Go. All right, pretty good to me. Well, let's get to it. And we're back at this green planet. I guess we've been here before. I'm starting to remember the worlds and what they look like. Alrighty, excited about this one. Arranged weapons, so we're definitely bringing a Purgator, and I'm gonna try to do the best with it. Oh, danger level high. Okay, we should be careful about making sure to bring some of our better units this time around. Also, what do we have here? 25 per turn Warp Surge. Yeah, that might make it dangerous. And a bunch of unknown minions of chaos. Fair enough. And let me guess, Poxus? Wow, Poxus? I never, I never thought that there would be Poxus. That's never happened before. Start mission. And plus two requisition for killing eight enemies. Yes, with ranged. All right. Now, in terms of who we'll bring, we'll bring. Uh, who's unavailable? Oh, the useless interceptor. Ha. Huh. Well, the one that we never used before. Storm's unavailable. Since it's high, I'm kind of tempted to say we replace you with our better purgator. So swap knight to. Uh, wait. What's your name again? Cadden Arugan. Arugan, yes. A uh, fool. We'll replace it with you. <sighs> Although, wait, loadout abilities. I swapped your guy's armor around, did I not? So, loadout, armor type, power armor. And you take the plus one armor from Derek, uh, from Rugen. Yes, reassign back. We really need some more basic armor, damn it. Alright, so that's you. Uh, Justinian Norellis did fairly decently last time, so. Yeah. I should have had a cameo by Alaric. Also, oh, you're oh, you're being carried by someone who's unavailable, therefore we can't actually use you. Oh, that's interesting. It's very interesting. I did not realize that. But I guess it makes sense. Uh, let's see. Forgiveness. Do we keep you or do we get the other guy now? I mean, you just leveled up. Actually, I'm now I'm trying to remember who has what. <laughs> who just got the new biomancy thing? Uh, you. Abilities. Yes, you just got Surgical Adept. Which is nice. Alright, fine, fine, fine. We'll bring you. We will bring you. Even though you don't have the servo skulls, and the second servo skull might be nice. But the, and the other guy did just get more biomancies. You know, we'll bring, we'll bring you nonetheless. And then Iolanthus will keep you in. 
I believe that's it. I'm kind of tempted to take a crack grenade, but I guess since we only have one grenade, we just bring the frag. If we have a decent amount of armor piercing available to us. Yeah, you know what? I think this is fine. We, it sounded like we got any new war gear over the last battle anyway. Let's get to it and start mission. Uh, do we have enough range firepower here? Yeah, I think we have enough range power, firepower. As long as, uh, as long as Derek can take care of this. Ooh. Do any armors need to be switched? We didn't switch the apothecary. We didn't switch. Now, okay, we're good. We're good. Yep. Alrighty, I'm excited about this uh, danger level high thing. Hopefully, we encounter some nasty foes. Though it is unfortunate that Voldred Storm isn't here to take care of them for us. Although it's probably a very bad idea to rely on a single knight to uh, uh, to do all the dirty work. All right, continue. Target's location reached. However, Vox communication patterns suggest normalcy. Lies and trickery. Whatever cult is here, it's been overwhelmingly successful. We will purge the planet if we must. But first, the blue spawn must be cut at its roots before its seeds spread any further. Alright, what was our objective? Spreader. Oh, interesting. Objective, spreader. Okay, so I guess we have to destroy that. Destroy the bloom spawn spreader. We also have a couple regular, or we have a regular bloom spawn here, which I guess we should probably pass by on our way there. And then, is that a seed? What is that? What is that? Bloom spawn vent delays the bloom spawn spreader from releasing its spores for one turn. Oh, oh, interesting. I don't know how these things work. I take it this is another one of those. Huh. Okay. Okay. Ah, oh, there's a patrol in here. Oh, please don't tell me there's a seed in here. Please don't make me go in here. Uh, there's another vent. I'm not seeing a seed, though. Okay. I'm just taking a quick look around if I can spot one. That, it, that's... No. Okay, that's not... Ah, no. Ah, yes. <laughs> Alright, there's one here. It is right beside the spreader, though. Uh, but it is away from the... Uh, it's away from the regular bloom spawn, unfortunately. We can do the max teleport to the, uh, to the or the uh, the gate of infinity to the spreader later on, though. All right, fine. I can look at the bloom spawn isn't an objective. Oh, the, is there another? Is there a seed in here? There is a seed in here. We should probably fight these guys. But then, wait, we have eight turns to do the. Oh, that's not a lot of turns. Uh, huh, I'm kind of thinking we have to head directly there, actually. Although I suppose taking one turn to destroy this one set of units isn't too bad. We do have to remember that we do have Gate of Infinity. Yeah, I think we go this way. Okay, so I think this is what we do. Ignoring this, we'll have Voldred Storm. Yeah. Oh, wait. No, we what have... Is your uh, will? We didn't bring him. Yeah. <laughs> I got too used to having him in here. Uh, we'll take Sounding you, ready. since you can run far. Grab this. Confirm or delay this. Or not. Hopefully they don't get plagued up from for doing this sort of thing. Oh, that increases our time. Okay, Bloom Spawns, the spreader will disperse its spores into nearby systems unless we destroy it first. Purifying its bloom vents can delay the dispersal for one turn. Okay, useful. Very useful indeed. Uh, you, you won't be able to teleport, but that's okay. It's not okay, but there's no the choice. All right, you go here. Let's get, a, let's get attacking. I am here to serve. Uh, you're gonna break through this, I think. With me, my brothers. And once again, I forgot which apothecary was. The Emperor likes uh, You our can path. do Iron Arm and War... Oh, you can do both of them. I guess we'll do Warp Speed on you so you can run in. And it's pointless to do you because, well, you'll uh, you'll be quick anyway. My right, blade so you go up here. is you. Let's do Warp Speed and let's head on in. Huh. Warp Speed right here. Confirm. This will steal your mind, brother. I don't know about stealing your mind, it'll hurt My your feet. Alright, and I think that's it. We could if we wanted to do Iron Arm, but uh, considering the willpower cost, I think it's not worth our time at the moment. Let's get to it. Smashy, smashy. May the powers protect us! That voice is pretty hilarious. Uh, was there not a. Oh, yeah, there was a seat in here. Alrighty, let's These see what we can do. These heretics will suffer the ultimate punishment. 
Now, uh, there's a seed carrier here. Ooh, hello. Oh, if I had left yeah. this guy here, he could go for him immediately. Damn. Uh, <laughs> that's unfortunate. Wait. You can teleport to him anyway. Wait, could we teleport strike? No, we probably don't want to waste the teleport strike. Uh, yeah, we can do this. I think. Hmm. Also, Unleash me. you have the astral aim. Uh, how far can you shoot? You can shoot this guy. If you Psychic Onslaught, you can kill three like that. Uh, if you Psychic Onslaught this guy... Wait, I can't hit him. Psychic Onslaught this guy. Were you not able to hit him? Okay, yeah, fine. Just do, just do this. Confirm. Yes. Ah! Love that ability. On the Imperium! Alrighty, that should make this considerably easier. We now need to only kill six enemies. With our range attacks, you can do... Are you not able to hit anybody from here? Hmm. That's a shame, but you can move up closer. Oh, you could vent this and then shoot somebody afterwards. I like that. Do it. Confirm. Onward, brothers. There we are. Oh, does he set it, like, on psychic fire when he does that? It's pretty cool. Uh, you, wait. You cannot kill anybody in a single go, can you? Uh, hmm. Okay. Not a big deal. Confirm. You're out in the open, which is concerning, though. Oh, yeah, I love that sound. Empty. Speaking of sounds, I love Terminator. Time for you to get to work. Uh, you can run up and kill this guy, and that'll... Ah, uh, that'll, uh, that'll cost too much. If you run up here, you can execute two of them, though I think this guy will be a problem. Hmm. All right, let me think about this. I'm actually kind of wishing I that I had brought the other... Uh, the other apothecary, because we could have used our servo skull to kill a few of these guys. Uh, you move here. Wait. Move here. Confirm. Moving swiftly. Then shoot this guy. Wait, you can't shoot this. Can you shoot this guy? You can shoot this guy at least. Yep. Nope. Feel my rock. Ah, ah I need. the Imperium. Then you. You can't run into melee. Oh, damn. Are you telling me you can't shoot anybody here? Damn that cover. Well, that's a crying shame. Uh, then, well, either way, we're going to teleport you in. Not teleport strike, just regular teleport. Go right here. Confirm. Please recover your AP. Mm, yes. I was about to say no dice, but yes dice. Uh, you. You have to hammer hand to guarantee the, uh, the steelies. Confirm. This is coming with me! The is guaranteed. Uh, then move up here and kill this guy. On the hunt! Uh, this is not relevant, but uh, do the plus one. Oh. I don't want to disable the range weapon, necessarily. Uh, you'll attack him. My blade you is yours. anybody? No, no. Damn, I screwed up the positioning. I swear I saw the uh, the arrow when I moved him here that was allowing us to select that guy, but apparently not the case. Uh, you can't move. I wanted to rush you in here, deal with this guy. The only problem there is that one of these guys will remain alive. Standing ready. I'm I'm, I'm kind of upset that you can't melee anybody. Ah, okay, servo skull. You already have warp speed, biomancy. Seriously, how how is it that you can't shoot? Standing ready. You know what else we could do? <laughs> we could honor the chapter on you and what have you do all the work for us again. Uh, huh? Wait. No, I don't want to waste the willpower. You can attack this guy with a regular attack. And you can move in here. And at least prevent this guy from firing. You know what? I think that's probably the better option. Let's do this. Uh, honor chapter on you. Confirm. Don't warp charge it. We're already going to have a lot of problems with uh, warp this, uh, this particular yeah. time. Then confirm. Kill this guy. Yes, and melee. But, you know, there will be more enemies to kill in I then you, you can execute this guy from here. Don't cybolt. Ah! And there you See go. See them fall, brothers. And then yeah. you, uh, you have two points, meaning you can age a shield, which will give you two armor, which will mean you'll take one damage. What is your will? You can't transfer your shield, unfortunately. We can blow this guy out of cover and prevent him. No, we can't. Anybody do anything? You, you, yeah, nothing. All right, fine. I'll take one damage for this. Sell. It's all good. It's all good. Aegis shield confirm. Wait, 
Wait, wait, wait, wait, wait. Can you run into this? No. Can anybody run into this? E e no, you can't. Damn. All right. My blade is used. Age of shield now. Confirm. I suppose we could have overwatched this guy, but... Uh... I'll just go for it. Wait. Oh, you can't actually reach him. Well, then it's probably a good idea that you Age of Shield. You know what? I guess we just Age of Shield everyone, then, and get them into cover. Uh, you... In front of this guy. Oh, man. <laughs> He's gonna shoot you. Uh, Age of Shield, confirm. I am the chosen shield. And then you... And eh, nothing you can do. Alright, move up. Hopefully they'll target you instead it of this guy. Then. Like so. And then you can't do anything, so you're gonna Overwatch. Which can't really go anywhere. This guy's just gonna go here and fire on you guys. We could teleport strike and do this, but the three willpower is, I think, not worth the, like, slight amount of damage we'll take for our trouble here. Yeah, do this in case this guy tries to run this way, because this feels pointless. If he runs out here, then, you know, let him confirm. Go. I wish we hadn't had to waste a turn like this, though. You know what I should have done? I should have warp charged, uh... Uh... <laughs> Yeah, that was not a lot of damage at all. I should have warp charged on her the chapter. That's what I should have done. Because our the bloom rose fairly high anyway, so it didn't change matters. Uh, anyway, you, me. can you attack this guy from here? Can if you reload, possibly. Uh, reload. Confirm. I have sanctified my rounds. Were your rounds not sanctified before you came here? Isn't that what you do when you prepare for battle? Concerned about the preparedness level of these Grey Knights. Uh, you Stopping move ready. here. We've got to remember that we got to kill this guy in... Uh, or not. In range. So fire on him once. And then we should probably give the Apothecary the kill, actually. What is your will? So go up here. And execute All right, brothers. Also, while Love. we're here, do this. Confirm. It will be done. Thank you. At least our seed stores are certainly growing. And do this. Confirm. Alright, how many more enemies do we need to kill in range? The blight we need ended. three. Okay, that's not too bad at all. Alright, start running forward, everybody. We got another thing, another event here. There's this bloom spawn here. So I guess the question is, will we break through this door? Or, I mean, this door is much closer. I guess the only issue is if there's another patrol there. I feel like we go around. Uh, either way, though, we do have to go after that, but I think there's something for you to do. Go, yep, confirm. With haste! I wonder if there's a maximum number of turns that you can do this one. As in, like, Praise the know. Emperor. It can't go above 10, for example, or something like that. Uh, but I assume not, because it would have said something. Or maybe it did and I didn't read it. Uh, you can go here. I don't want to advance too far, just in case there's a patrol that we haven't seen. Not looking good so far. I don't see chaos lurking in the shadows, so we're good. Yeah. Away you go here. And then you can do the same thing as soon as that guy makes it. There you go. And the same me. Way. Right here. Yes, sir. Alright, I guess we're all going through this door because it's closer to the bloom spawn. Plus, we don't want to waste our gate of infinity. We'll save that for the uh, the spreader. Oh, there is an oh, hopefully they don't go through that door. I don't know if they can, but hopefully they do not. And your knights have oh, you gotta be kidding. Minus one max willpower. Oh, that hurts. That really hurts. And that is indeed yeah. painful. Okay, okay. Uh, you go up to the door, and then I guess you can break through it. Uh, next, ooh, can't go that far. Okay, wait. What about you? Standing ready. You can go right up to it, but I guess you can teleport there, so there's no real need. Uh, we should probably give you warp speed so you can advance huh. closer. Actually, the what question is, is whether we warp speed. My blade is yours. Yep. Yeah, we'll warp speed you. Uh, go for warp speed by Mancy. Thank you. Confirm. Strike swiftly, brother. Because we want to activate this turn before any more bloom spot or any more uh, warp surges cross over. All right, so you're gonna go right here, Ulrich. Or not. And you break through right after. Don't tell me there's a what? Oh, I didn't even see that, huh? 
I didn't even see an Auspex thing. Oh, well, that's not good. Oh, that's really not good. Because we... have screwed over our points. The enemies of man cannot stand before us. Yeah, that's really, really not so great. Oh, wait, actually, no, our points are back. Never mind. Not great, but it isn't awful. Uh, if you go here... I'm hoping that you can shoot the statue and collapse it on them. I know that there's a seed carrier there, but I don't see... I don't see much of a choice. Uh, let's... Try like this. I mean, I suppose... Wait. Now this guy's too far. You can't teleport that far. We got completely screwed by this. I can't believe I missed it. Oh. Up here, please. Yes, sir. And... Shoot this thing. Oh, I can't reach him. Damn, and it'll kill the seed carrier without the other guy. <laughs> uh, I assume it can't be knocked back. So there's probably no point in doing a grenade. Yeah, the rest yeah. Of, everybody else is real far here. Okay, you know what? Uh, Apothecary, I want you... Oh, you can't even do... Wor uh, you can do warp speed again. You'll be out of uh, willpower, but you know what? I think that's what we have to do here. I guess the question is, for who? You can at least teleport, and no matter what you do, you'll have to waste one AP, so I guess we give it to you. Confirm. This will steal your mind, brother. Right, there you go. I must meditate. All of your willpower gone, so you can just walk up as far as you can, because you can't shoot anybody right now. Watch these guys break out the door, because they are moving this way. Turning out to be a pretty fun battle, though, I gotta admit. Seeking the tainted. Might have to use our clicks over here. Uh, then you yeah. have no choice but to go through here. Go. I am with you. Actually, I feel like I could have just teleported, but whatever, too late. Alright, what are we looking at here? Uh, teleport strike can't reach them, but regular teleport should be able to. If only I could see exactly where the bloom spawn is, and whether we can actually attack it. You're already down in terms of your remaining AP. I would like for you to actually be in range. Me. Hmm. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Where's our you guy? <sighs> you guy? <laughs> uh, you go here. Wait, from here, can you shoot anybody? Uh, you might be able to do some AoE damage. Fine, do it. Yes, sir. All right, here, at least you guys are in cover. And then if you go for this guy... What? Uh, I did, I misclicked, I think. Yeah, there we go. If you Psychic Onslaught, you'll be able to hit three. Alternatively, we could Astral Aim him and steal the seed, but I think... I think we're in, a, in enough of a precarious position where we actually need to do the Astral Aim instead. Uh, do this. I mean, the other option is, of course, what collapsing it on you, but then we'll have wasted two shots on doing that, and I don't like that. I don't like that at all. My blade yeah, you know what? Astral Aim. Or not, uh, Psychic Onslaught, rather. Although, honestly, it'll do the exact same thing as doing this, minus the fact that it'll take away a lot of armor. Nah, fine, do it. Plus, I really like that ability. We are you the uh, then you, you could run up and attack that thing, hit it twice, you might actually be able to kill it. Not allow it to do any of its fancy stuff, so force strike it. It'll have one AP- Oh man. Maybe he'll- This one will fall! What was I about to say? Did the thing die yet? Yeah, die, okay. That's a lot safer. Uh, Bloom Spawn Resilience. Bloom Spawn Spreader draws power from feculent Gnarl Maws in the area. Destroying the Gnarl Maws will first will make it easier to defeat the Spreader, but take care not to delay too long, presumably because of this. Fair enough. We will try to take care not to delay. Okay, you can you can stop that. Uh, teleport here up to this thing. Confirm. Alrighty. Now, you absolutely need to attack. Yeah, I think we have no choice but to give you Quicksilver, because otherwise it'll do its AoE plague attack, and I don't want to deal with it. Can Quicksilver go? Confirm. Let's see if you can crit this thing enough to kill it. Also, does anybody else here have enough moves remaining? No, just you. So you could either kill this guy or kill this guy. Or, wait, if you grenade yourself... No, that won't be enough. Okay, never mind. I am Back. here to sell. Force strike. Uh, is it worth it to force strike? Yeah, maybe. Yes, plus two damage. Can we destroy this thing? Do another four strike. Actually, I do believe we can. Two more attacks will kill it anyway. Confirm. Yeah, each attack will hit it for five. 
Ah, uh, Lizzie's real happy. I uh, confirm. And one more time. Run, run, run! No four strike. One unit will survive, but uh, I think that's pretty good. Go. Alrighty, nice. And then... Yeah, really too bad that the grenade can't even kill him. Uh, kill this guy with his full HP. What kind of weapons are they both carrying? Do you have? You have a... Uh, heavy Stubber shoots a target at range 14 to deal 3 damage versus you who has a auto gun. Shoot a target at range 14, deal 4 damage. So the, wait, the auto gun is, deals more damage than the heavy Stubber? Really? Huh. Yeah, it does. Interesting. Not quite what I expected. Confirm anyway. Tag. Oh, I should have killed him in range. Whoops, my bad. How many, how many do we still need to kill in range? Oh, these fools. guys are coming in. <laughs> yeah, well, we, pre we, we predicted that, to be fair. And they were moving here. Permission to engage, yeah, it seems like missions are getting uh, getting a little bit more interesting lately. I've been very happy with it. Alright, we're suppressed. Alrighty, we got two kill two more enemies with yeah. ranged weapons. Now you oh yeah, you can't tell. You can reg you teleport uh, up all the way up here and uh, hammer hand this guy as well. Which is probably the best option. Right after our ranged unit. Uh not to you, Iolanthus, you. Can you shoot wait, if you shoot this. Now oh, you can collapse it on this guy. Interesting. Uh but that's not what I wanted. We could use Oh, you don't have sanctified kill zone, damn. We attack you, wait, with a regular attack. Are you out of willpower? What's, what's up with you? Wouldn't you be able to uh, do the thing? The warp charge thing? Why are we not able to right now? I'm a little bit confused. Oh, you don't have enough ammo for it, most likely. Uh, we could fire once, reload, fire again, but then we want to do range damage. So I guess it's better off, we're better off to fire right now, aren't we? Right, fine, use the reload, confirm. Armed and ready. I know it seems like a waste, but yeah, there we go. I want the I want the AOE. It's worthwhile because it'll kill two and badly damage another. Confirm, please. There we go. Ah, uh, you know what I should have done? Should have the first. Wow, that did a lot more damage than I was expecting. My blade to. is ever ready. Huh? Wait, Standing you ready. lost. You're telling me he lost 6 HP, 5 plus 1 armor? Oh, damn, that guy was doing a lot more damage. Huh, I thought he'd do like 3, so he'll take 2. Whoops. Crazy well, you're not available for next mission, that's for damn sure. At the very least, we killed the uh, enemies with the ranged weapons. Uh, Medicaid Servo Skull, time to go now. There you go. Not that we need to... Well, we should probably save you one of the later on. Uh, yeah. Is. is it time for you to teleport right now? I think it is. Teleport. Let's hope you recover your points. Go here. Gliding. Watch well, should be another freaking uh, uh, another freaking thing here. No, okay, we're good. We're looking good. Also, was there not a seed somewhere here? There's a bunch of vents everywhere. I swear I saw a seed somewhere. I think it was one one of these buildings earlier. Uh, it's probably in one of these ones. Ah, it's right there. I guess we could go forward towards that anyway, and then uh, teleport to the big. The big bad. Uh, oh, you can't hammer hand. You're out of willpower. Uh, damn. Well, that ain't so great. Uh, we could force strike. Hmm. Well, we can increase our crit quite a bit. Might be able to take the seed anyway. Try it. We yes, we will. Dead. Beautiful. Please. Not that that matters at this point. I've built a Lovely job. Now, the rock. question is whether you want to kill this guy. Hmm, we definitely want to run up and kill that guy. Oh, there's two more in here? Damn. Uh, well, it's unlikely that we can kill them both. You. I am here to serve. You could run up and you could honor the chapter. Your grenade will also most likely be able to kill them both. Wait, wait, wait. First, go here. Confirm. So we could do this right. Way. If you grenade these guys... Ah, oh, they won't both die, damn. But... Oh, you can't even shoot them? I feel like you gotta honor the chapter. Ooh. Tempting. Ah, uh, no, no, no. I want you. What is your will? Because you have points to actually run up here. We could still fire on this and collapse it on this guy, killing him instantly. 
might still be worth it. Or we could have you run up. Fairly unlikely that this will be all that useful. Actually, I wonder why if you fire at this thing, use. you can instantly collapse and kill that guy. Which I think is probably worth it. Confirm. My nice, nice. Yeah, just destroy everything Another in sight. Unleash <laughs> uh, me! Alright, now you. You do have ammo. And while this feels like a little bit of a waste, I think we're gonna do this anyway. Because you can't you can't hit the other ones from here, can you? Oh you can. Okay, well then hit that guy then. Nice. And then we'll move the apothecary up to actually melee help, but the melee won't kill him. Uh now nah, we'll just collapse the thing. Like so. Confirm. Back fiend! Oh wow, that actually knocked you back? Damn. I, I thought that since it did no damage, that wouldn't happen. Oh, don't Another tell me you're too far down. to kill these guys now. Uh, Here. Be very unfortunate. Yeah, now it'll cost you an extra point to move in. Wow, I screwed that up. <laughs> oh, what a shame. Uh, hmm. Okay, okay, okay. You still have two points remaining. Is there any chance you could run up here and do something? No. I uh, could do this. You climb up here, could you shoot through the window? No, you cannot. Yeah, I guess it's a pretty damn high window. Who builds windows that high, damn it? I guess people who want to protect you. Uh, okay, fine then. Not what I wanted to do, but then honor the chapter. Confirm. Don't warp charge. Seek and destroy, brother! Enjoy. And then you are gonna kill... Ah, uh, wait, go for this guy first. <laughs> Glory to Cyprus! Alrighty. Man, the Interceptors make all the other classes look a little bit inferior, don't they? Uh, let's attack you. Onward, brothers. Oh, for the love of... <laughs> Another thing over there. I think it's cool. uh, although we are getting XP, so not even mad. Uh, yeah, wait, 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 wait. Don't confirm this yet. I Standing want ready. you to first do this. Because we'll recover points as soon as the uh, battle is over, so we might as well move right now before, uh, before doing this, though. Nice. I think we should get like a minor amount of XP for doing that. And I believe that's it. Alrighty, and if the seed is in here, go through this. Although, wait, can they see? Hmm. I guess that's a window, so they might be able to see us through that. I guess we will see. Or as I said earlier, we have a seed. Alrighty, there we go. Now, I guess everybody's moving up, but I guess if we're going to Gate of Infinity anyway, we don't really have to move everybody around. Uh, if we go here, will this thing spot us? Oh, that's that's kind of making me uncomfortable. It's not. Uh, confirm this. Eyes up. Nice job. Oh, also, before I forget, this is the 15th episode and thus a 5th episode in the series, and that's what when I like to remind will. you guys not to forget to drop those likes and comments below if you've been enjoying this particular uh, content or similar content in general. I want to see it uploaded more often as engagement determines all that stuff on YouTube. There we go, that was quick. Uh, <laughs> I've said it so many times, it's like uh, it's like muscle memory at this point. It's kind of interesting. Uh, you. Damn, you won't be able to get the seed in one turn, so we won't be able to immediately use Gate of Infinity. Oh well. The worst thing that could happen is if these guys spot you through the window. Is this worth the risk? Can you actually see through this window? That's the real question. One of the real questions. Are we really gonna risk this for one seed? I think we're gonna. Just in case, let's move everybody up though. Yeah. Oh, in fact, no, you know what we'll do? We'll save you, because if the enemies activate, we'll move you right here, and then we'll Gate of Infinity to that thing instead, I think. Because everybody's so far away. Yeah, I think that's the safest way to do it. You are going to go up here just in case, though. And, oh wait, there's a thing here. Can you reach this? Yes, indeed you can. I feel like perhaps they can't see through these windows, because wouldn't, we be able to, wouldn't they be able to see us through here? No, I don't think they have a line of sight. Uh, down there. Alright, like that. And oh, the warps is gonna surge. Warps. Uh, warp is gonna surge again. Uh, can you move again? Your orders? Yes, a little bit. Let's move you further in. Moving now. All right, interceptor. Where you go? 
Let's move you here. Let's see if we can reach that seed. Come on. Pretty good. Like good so far. And if these guys aren't activated, we can go for that next turn. Oh, yes, you can see through that window. Oh, damn. Uh, well, that has me concerned because of these guys. That Well, they are moving away. So perhaps we're still okay. As long as we move like here and then here. All right, we'll take the chance. Uh, then you are not going to move anywhere. You're just going to sit here. Instead of activating that thing. Although that will save us a bloom spawn. But you know what? We might as well let this happen now rather than we're, when we're fighting. As it could go very bad otherwise. Go. Because we could get one of the, like, the worst ones. Like the five armor one. And uh, this is not a good time to get that. Alright, let's see what we got. Another one of these? Damn. Well, it's certainly stacking that annoyance. Uh, we're going to have to do this without willpower abilities primarily. When we fight the uh, the big bad. Uh, you. Arelis. All right, wait, let's go here and hope that they don't spot us. Yes, sir. We're good? Yes. And then you're going to go he here. Here. Firm. Eyes off. What? Why? That is not what I wanted. Well, that's annoying. I must have accidentally double-clicked. Oh, well. Firm. All right, there you go, Rillis. Objective gaming and the Emperor done. lights are apothecary. Path. Oh, you don't have the willpower. Damn it! <laughs> oh, the annoyance. Uh, you, I guess you're just gonna break on through, and then we're gonna go Gate of Infinity after we recover all of our points. Yep, confirm. It's that destination. Yeah. On the way. Not like we can buff anybody. Did I reload? Oh, we don't need to reload because our combat ended. Why, hello. Oh, that's a big boy. <laughs> Alrighty, what do we got? How much HP does it have, I wonder? It's gonna be like 50, isn't it? Just look at the vile thing. Show it no mercy. The warp shudders below. Be swift, Commander. The enemy attempts to intervene. How does the enemy not attempt to intervene? Oh man, we could really use an incinerator here. Oh wow, they're gonna spawn reinforcements like right where we're right, right where we are. What do we have here? <laughs> what do we have here? It's right in front of me. Uh okay, so first of all. This thing seems like a pretty decent target right now. Uh, though the question is... Hmm, well, it'll kill a seed carrier, unfortunately. I guess we could do this and not kill the seed carrier and have somebody else do it. Uh, you know, I'll do that in a second. I just want to consider a couple things first. First of all, you have how much? 30 HP. That's actually not as bad as I thought. Uh, hmm... What will a grenade do in this situation? Not much. Wow, our grenades... Grenades have grown a lot weaker. They're not as used, nearly as useful as they used to be because enemies have gotten more HP. Yeah, I think we need to either find better grenades or switch out to different types of... Uh, different types of war gear. Either way, you. Let's do this. Right here. Confirm. Wait, this can't, this can't hit the big plant, can it? No. Yeah, do this. Confirm. This one will fall! It's gonna knock the rest away. Yeah! Alright, then, what we wanna do... Wait, if we do this... Yeah. Alright, either way, we have to go Gate of Infinity right now, everybody in. Right... Why can't it... There you go. Hopefully the range units aren't too close. Eh, whatever. Confirm. Alrighty, and oh, you are in the worst position. It's not where I wanted you. Uh, you're supposed to melee jerks. I guess we'll have you unleash me. Teleport strike. You do that. Oh wait, no, 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 damn it. Do it again. Ooh, can we iron arm biomancy you? Serve. No. Oh right, right, right. I, I, I should have known that. <laughs> I should have, and yet I didn't. Uh, this will kill that guy, but... You know what, I think now is not the time to waste hammer hands, so... Oh, then again. What's back here? No, that's not the way to do it. Uh, like... So... What? I thought we had... I thought I had done it in such a way where we could actually hit this thing as well. Oh, wait. Like... So. There we go. That's pretty good. And then... Spawn right beside it anyway. Yeah. That's very decent. Go for it. 
Very nice, very nice. Alrighty, now I want you to Purgator. If you Astral Aim, you can take the seed and kill this guy. Uh, you'll have one ammo remaining, so you'll be able to kill that guy. Or you could Astral Aim this guy, prevent him from exploding. And then nobody will get that, but not the end of the world. Hmm. Also you, what's the distance you've got? Oh wait, you can hammer hand as well, can you not? You can, so you could take you could take the seed. Yes, Iolanthus. Yes, alright. Take the seed with the hammer hand. Go. On the hunt. Very nice. This is coming with me. Then I want I guess Stand you if you can hammer hand this guy, or do you do you want to use all your AP to attack this thing? The thing is, this thing needs to die. I don't know what this does. In fact, let's read what it does. Foul Eruption. Target a blast over area 2 at range 14 to deal 4 damage and random and enemies heal. Yeah, that's pretty not so great for us. And passives. Unit gains plus 5 armor and 2 blasts for each damage for each feculent Gnarl Maw, which we don't have any, and it's immune to afflictions. Okay. Okay, I'm wishing we had a little bit more willpower, but oh well. Uh, you can execute this guy in 2 shots. Or you could shoot this thing and actually deal some damage. Uh, we could ignore the plagueification from that guy, though it will cost us in terms of HP. My blade we I could have unleash you me. fire at. Wait, what if you use Psychic Onslaught on this? Ah, the AoE isn't large. Okay. If you use this, you can hit both of them, including killing that guy. Might be worthwhile. Though that guy will then explode, but whatever. Let's do that. Let's still hit both, confirm. For Titan! There we go. It's a little bit less we damage and requires the Then, oh, did you recover your AP? Oh, nice. Uh, if you had recovered your ammo, I'd be a lot happier. But now you can shoot this thing once. Or you can shoot this guy. Well, either way, I think we attack will. you at least once. Oh, you, you don't even have the willpower for hammer hand anyway. Though, if sell. you could honor the chapter, this guy, and warp charge it. He will gain 3 AP and 1 willpower, which will allow him to hammer hand and attack this thing. This is pretty damn swell, so confirm this. There we go. Now you have 5 AP, mister. Uh, you can hammer hand this guy, which will prevent him from exploding. Yes. Very nice. And then you can attack this thing repeatedly. Uh, with four strikes, it still won't be enough. To kill it, I mean. Actually, wait. We could do three four strikes and then go after one of these guys afterwards. Uh, in fact, wait, 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 wait. We still have other units. Although you have to focus on this guy first, right? Nah, fine. Deal with this guy. Thibault not doesn't really help Damn. us in this situation. Oh, I guess one of the unfortunate things is that you need to move into cover because somebody's spawning here and it could be somebody dangerous. You should probably move there afterwards. And Dialanthus is stuck. We should make My sure the others aren't stuck. You. Uh, you will attack this, it'll go down to 16. Praise if you attack Emperor. this, it'll go down to 17. So you're better off using this on you. Confirm. Feel my rock. And then going into cover to prevent additional injury. Right here. We strive. Actually, I don't know. Will we teleport out once this thing is dead? Uh, yeah. Well, we should probably test the theory. So confirm one. Hey, plus two damage. Nice. Damn, we just four strike then, because we could have then done this in less hits. Uh, do a four strike now. Plus two damage. We can survive with two. If we had that servitor, or the servitor, servo skull that did damage, Lord. that would. Uh, I'll do this for us. Uh, you can attack in melee. Why do I want to attack you in melee? Because we can move you into cover for when these guys come in. Uh, that would will not do anything about the guys over here. Is there one or two? I thought I saw another one back here, but I could be wrong. All right, go into melee, and that'll. Oh, that won't destroy it. Ooh, that, that was a big. That was almost a big mistake. Wait, that's one HP. Yeah, it'll have one HP. Okay, fine. If you have no choice, then you're just gonna range attack it. Let's see if this teleports us immediately. Actually. Regardless of whether yeah. it does, I still want you to get a free kill because it's more free XP. Firm. I am with you. <laughs> Glory to Very Cyphus. nice. And lastly, unless there's a seed in range, which there does not appear to be, we should be good. And you get the kill then. Confirm. 
This one will fall! And... Job well done, yes. Commander. The Plague God will rage at our victory today. Alright, I think that was pretty nice. We got one wounded knight, the... Uh, uh, who was it that got wounded? Was it, it was either the Apothecary or the... No, 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 I think it was the Purgator that got uh, badly wounded from one hit that I screwed up with. But otherwise, I think that was pretty damn swell. Alright, so continue this. I'm blanking on what the rewards were. I feel like I remember them being pretty good, so exciting times. Exciting times ahead in the next few seconds. Guess who's back? All right, what do we got here? No, nine seeds from that? Damn, that was pretty damn nice pickup. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we got two year two Terminator armor and tier two war gear, okay. Let's see what we got here. Uh, first of all, we have a stun upgrade tier one incinerator, which is not a big deal, at least until we can get that uh, purifier. We got another warding stave because apparently the game wants to keep on giving us these forever. Uh, we got a... We got a terminator piece with an increase to focus. Hmm, and an upgrade to further increase focus in our end. This one actually seems pretty good. I think we're going to take it. I do wish that it had a willpower upgrade like the one we got recently. And hey, we got another focus. You know what? I guess it's time to start specking into focus. We've got a few people with autos now, so we can get plus 15 and plus 35 on, the, on these two pieces alone. Is this a direct percentage ad? Like if it's 50% to... Uh, to trigger an auto, does carrying both of these, the plus 50% mean that we basically guarantee the uh, the trigger? Is that how it works? Or is it not? If somebody could explain that to me, I would be forever grateful. Alright, let's take these, and then I am tempted to take the tier 5 Apothecary, but I think it's not necessary at the time. It is tempting. But, uh, you know, wait... Aren't we also able to send these guys back to Titan if we need the extra requisition at any time? I remember we could... huh. And I did want to try to bleed Apothecary, but then again... You know what, let, let's, let's, let's hold off on that for now, I don't think it's necessary. Uh, let's... Uh, ooh. Actually, I'm thinking now, is there any reason not to do this? If they, if they give us... If we recover two points every time, shouldn't we take every single one of these, and then the ones we don't like, we just send back to Titan? You know, I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna see if it does give us two and not one if we do this. And we just send them back to Titan and see, because if it gives one, then doing this is not worth it. If it gives two back every time, then this reward does have to be selected every single time, because then you can uh, pick and choose out of the... Uh, out of the uh, random abilities that they get and the, uh, you know, the quirk that each you know yet but nobody's commented to, for, to me to do that which is kind of concerning because i feel like i'm misinterpreting how this works but anyway now purgador got hurt but he did get promoted for his efforts so i think that's fair enough all right and yeah so i just want to quickly see before we call this episode if we who's the new guy uh you i think Kim. if we send you back to titan it's two wait and then Strategium, wait, 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 Barracks. We sent it's you back right. to Titan, it's one, why? Is it because we started with this guy? I don't think we started with Torvald this sad, did we? Huh. Uh, what about you, Voldred Storm? Oh, maybe it's dependent on level, oh, we can't even select, okay, fine, I'll land this. Back to Titan, two. Wait, so, so why would we ever not pick that? Huh. Yeah. If it always is returned to Titan 2. Actually, let's just take a quick look here. You have resistance. Yeah, you're going back to Titan. <laughs> I don't like what you have, I think. Uh, you are specced into Endurance Biomancy, but it's similar to the way that our other one has specced. Uh, you have nothing all that useful for this. Just plus 10% to Resilient. And yeah, if you were specced into Bleed... Or wait, Bleed is down here. If you were... Oh, the Knight's Melee attack can collect all Bloom Seeds from the target without using things. Yeah, if you respect into this and this, that might be interesting enough to bother with. But because you're not, I don't see any reason to 
hold on to you at this time. Not that this is horrible, because if we were to level you up, we could keep this and then put you up here to servo skulls, get another one with servo skulls, but do we really need two to do the exact same thing? I'd really like variety more. Anyway, I'm getting ahead of myself, probably gonna send this guy back to Titan next time, but I am gonna call it here. Uh, speaking of next time, we will advance to the next mission. No, we will not. We had to go here, and thus we have to skip out on some other nice stuff, which is all unreachable at this time. Damn, I guess we got uh, we got put into a unfortunate position in terms of reaching the other things. Oh, well, it's okay. I think it was still a pretty worthwhile find that we got there. Uh, I guess stay tuned next time for a little bit more advancement in time and a little bit more uh, and uh, new blooms that we can hopefully choose from. So don't forget to leave a like and comment for your friendly neighborhood heretic, whatever else I usually say. All glory to the algorithm. And thanks for watching.